the Akron Zips men's basketball team played back-to-back -back games against the Miami Red Hawks, one at home on Friday, February 4th, and the other on the road on Sunday the 6th. In Game 1, Akron got off to a hot start thanks to great ball movement and strong rim presence by Aziz Bandago. However, Miami would keep this game close throughout most of the first half. Didi Grant nails this triple as he would lead the Red Hawks in scoring with 18 points on the night. For the Zips, Enrique Freeman led the way with 21 points, going 9 for 13 from the field. Freeman also led both teams in rebounds with 11. Here, Bandago continues to assert his dominance at the rim with this monstrous dunk on Miami's precious Aya. Makai Larry was Miami's second leading scorer, coming off the bench with 12 points. Akron would lead 30-27 at halftime, but Isaiah coleman lands would keep this game close with this triple. Miami made 33% of their shots from behind the arc. Enrique Freeman would continue to dominate on both ends of the floor while also getting scoring help from Xavier Castaneda and Ali Ali, who both scored in the double figures to help Akron run away with the lead. The Zips would win their first game by a final score of 66-55. Akron would improve to 14-6 on the season, while the Red Hawks would continue to fall in the standings and drop to 9-12. Two days later, both teams would rematch in Oxford. Miami gets off to an early lead with help from Makai Larry, who, despite coming off the bench, led the Red Hawks in scoring with 27 points. Miami's second leading scores were Precious Aya and Isaiah coleman lands who only put up 8 points each. Aziz Bandago brings out his inner Evan Mobley with this thunderous block at the rim, denying Elijah McNamara. Brian Trimble Jr. nails a couple of triples to swing the momentum towards Akron's way. Trimble was one of four Zips players with double-digit points, including Greg Trimble, Xavier Castaneda, and Ali Ali, who led Akron with 21 points. Akron led 28-26 at halftime, but would once again run away with the lead in the second half. As a team, the Zips shot for over 52% from both the field and behind the arc. Miami only made less than 40% of their field goals and shot only 30% from deep. Akron also out-rebounded Miami 36-20, helping the Zips maintain control of the game. Akron would complete the sweep over the Red Hawks by winning 71-59. The Zips would continue to dominate the standings by holding a 15-6 record, while Miami falls to 9-13 on the season. This is Dan Groen with the ZTV Sports Report, and thank you for watching.